Oh, four flashlights, nice. Like, this is legitimately painful, honestly. Like, I, I, I sat in a queue for 15 minutes last night. And it was a, um, it was like a meta, um, a meta swift, I think. Um, either, either it was a swift or they were just really coordinated to solar players. Um, <laughs> so yeah, um, and it, like, I was playing spirit and I'm not the best spirit. I had no, no add-ons because, um, I prestiged her, uh, before the update. Interesting. And, um, yeah, it was kind of dumb. It felt like, um, <sighs> like, I, I like the dead hard nerf, but, like, now we're just running spin burst. And it's kind of, like, boring for different reasons. Speaking of career, how is the job hunting going? I remember you were saying that, um, you were, um, what do you call it? Well, they're all behind you. Behind me. I'm going to go for this person who's out in the room. Hello. Okay, she's got rid of her spin burst already. They're not going to have a good time if they're trying to flash like me. This way. Okay, that kind of looks strange. I shouldn't have proven actually. But yeah, how's your job thing, job hunting going? You said you had an interview. Quick and quiet. Quick and quiet head on. She's used three flash three pallets back here already, so that's not good for her. I'm not gonna bait this. I'm gonna try and play it. Yeah, I thought she'd try and run for main building already. The question is where's her swift? I see scratch marks back here. Hmm, interesting. Fair enough. Oh. You always think when you um, get people with flashlights that they like know the timing and stuff like that. Level. I mean, it's actually good if they miss a flashlight time for me because that's um, time they put into like not doing gens. And then, oh, we can get this um, gen effect from here. Ha <laughs> ha, they weren't expecting that. She should trade, honestly. And she definitely shouldn't go down here, right next to the hook. I want to play nice on them and not get the um, canvas, but I easily could. But like honestly, I like flashlight gamers. It's like a lot more fun. But yeah, like going down next to someone who's hooked, not a good idea. Someone's on this gen, I hear them. See, I get suspicious whenever there's spoons now. Because generally when there's spoons, it means it's not circle. Oh. Um, Because the other day, uh, someone booed against me. And it was a... Um, like, they rebooted when I snuffed it. And then it turned out it was a... Um, what do you call it? A exponential. And the exponential, like, actually lost me in the game. I'm going to check this. Boon's back here. <laughs> Pressure's on that last person to go get the save now. I mean... It kind of confuses me when people crouch next to fountains that they like 
are looking at, basically. Why did I down this jail? It was somewhere around here. They're the same colour as the bushes. Here we are. Good bit more pressure, got time to do this. They're running this way behind. Oh, hey. What do you want? That was dead hard, I think. So yes, okay. But there's no pallets back here, so she's just going to die. Okay, that was... That was a play, I guess. I wonder why they sent me here. This is not generally a map you want to go to as a survivor. See, this is what I don't like about um, UBT. This thing's just like fucked off, and I have no idea where she is. And now I've just got like that jilt to chase. Which is something that I, I don't know. I think if there was like a reading on the person who, um, like, unhooked the person, then I'd feel more comfortable with like basic DS. But the problem is that I find is that a lot of survivors just unhook someone and they go away. And that's my main problem with um, BT as well. Um, well, not BT. Um, with DS, with like all these antitunnel perks, it kind of like forces you to chase the person who you um, did hook, which is fair enough, you know. I think that was Lyre that didn't dance with me. Yeah, it was. I bet this is right next to a fountain. She had track part of that. I don't know why she didn't take it. She got stuck. Let's block this. I forgot I opened this. It's kind of funny. I didn't think about it that way. Why don't you be kind to me right next to me? Oh, that um, chest almost uh, saved her. That thing has unbreakable because the Jill didn't pick herself up. It didn't pick her up because it was a um, no thingy. They're giving us a few balls to work with. It's kind of nice. So bye boys, but are you? 
Hello. Bit of a shame, this has been a fun game up until now, but I think they're both just vying to be the last one out. Wishing a pity bone to deal with, because I've not got much way of tracking them. This is when I wish I was Doctor and could just get like random Doctor illusions. have life, right? Are you going to go for the window at the back? Yes, you are. Let's get to... Interesting, was that not right? I'm going to bait this while she gets infected. Maybe she has dance with... Not dance with me. Maybe she has, um... Lightweight. Because her scratch marks are really weird. I heard the jail. Yeah, the jail's here. Yeah, she did have uh, lightweight. Camper? What? When did I camp someone? Any anyone? No, when I camp someone? Oh my god, it's Cow! Hi, Cow! Yeah, I know what he's saying. It's kind of insane. Like, I think what they're talking about is the start of the game when the survivor ran me to the hook and I said, I'm going to let this person get the un unhooked because I feel sorry for them. And it's the start of the game. Uh, which is really sad. Also, how are you saying? Uh, nice seeing you. But yeah, survivors are like... Kind of weird. Um, 